Hello, this is lecture number 4 on industrial hydraulics and pneumatics. In lecture number 2 and 3, we have seen a two cylinder problem. But here, this is a different than 1, 2, 3 lectures. Here, there are three cylinders as well as we have considered here a delay. Okay. So, you see the question. A draw a pneumatic circuit A plus B plus C plus B minus A minus delay C minus. Sometimes it may be hydraulics also or pneumatic also. In hydraulic only difference, this becomes 4 by 2, 4 by 2, 4 by 2, 4 by 2, 3 by 2 and 3 by 2. Here it is, if it is a pneumatic, then 5 by 2, 5 by 2, 5 by 2, 5 by 2, 3 by 2, 3 by 2. Here, a half of the problem I have drawn. Here, this is the first cylinder, S1 and S2 are limit switch, pneumatic limit switch. S3 and S4 are pneumatic switch. S5 and S6 are pneumatic, pneumatic switch. Okay. That is called limit switch, limit switch. Now, you see the question. I will divide the question into two parts. I will divide the question into two groups specially. A plus B plus C. Okay. So, I will divide into one group because all are forward. Otherwise, half. Half I will divide into one group and this is a second group. So, this becomes group 1. So, I have written here group 1 and this is a group 2. I have written here group 2. So, basically these are called 5 by 2 uh, what pilot operated and this is very important how the this valve is working. This is also 5 by 2. When, when this is on, this position is on, when this position is on, above line group 1 is on and group 2 is off. When? If, when? if I press this, this line is on, this line is off. Presently, the A, presently at this situation, even, even though I have not pressed anything, but still I have given the connection to what? Group 2, you see here. This is a compressor. Only one compressor is sufficient, but I am showing the compressor at different level. Okay. So, we will start the problem. Group 1, group 2. First is A plus. And very important thing. So, how to start? Because may I give a, give a name S1, S2, S3, S4, S5, S6. And one more thing you have to consider or take care the S1 should not repeat, S2 should not repeat, S3 should not repeat because these are called input signals. The signals, input signals, so walls are output. Now here you see here last, always you see the last C minus. So this is a C minus, you know, this is a C plus, this is a B plus, this is B minus, this is A minus, A plus and A minus, you know. So, C minus he has given, C minus means the this is on, when this is on, the piston goes to S5. So that, I will consider here S5. This is very important. Okay. And, when the S5 is on, already S5 is on, when S5 is on, my A plus should on. A plus means what? This position should on. And now, when S5 is on, which line is on? So, group 1 or L1 line, group 1, this is called group 2. Now, S5 is on means what? Group 1 is on means A plus, directly I will give the connection A plus. Now, when A plus this position is on, now the piston moves from S1 to S2. The piston moves from S1 to S2. Now, the B plus, B plus this, but here this is required a condition, it should move yes, S1, well, already the supply is at the group 1 because the this S5 is on, this position is on. So that I need one more 3 by 2, one more 3 by 2 here, one more 3 by 2 spring return and name is what and the supply is available here. Okay. The name is what? S2. When S2 is on, sequential, sequential, when it moves to S2, here already supply is there, S2 is on, now it moves to S4. When S4, you see here C plus is required, means C plus is here, but condition is that after B plus means when the piston moves to S4. Now the piston is at S4, so that I need one more condition, 
one more condition is that I need one more condition spring return this is called S4 only you have to take care you should not repeat S2, S2, S3, S3 now S5 is there S2 is there S5 no repetition now here already supply is there supply okay now it moves to where S6 it moves to S6 the group 1 is over group 1 is over now group 2 what is the position of the piston now for to start the group 2 that is S6 so that I'll write S6 when S6 is on the group 2 when X is X, S6 is on means now this is on second group 2 line line 2 is on now line 1 is off now line 1 is off line 2 is on because S6 is on because you see here already it has reached to S4 S6 in second group B minus so this is the line already here is available directly I will give to B minus directly here goes to here the position if this is on the piston goes to where now S3 when S3 next is what A minus for A minus condition it should reach to S3 so that I need one more 3 by 2 here spring return and here that is called what it reaches to S3 now when reaches to S3 so already now group 2 line is on when S3 it comes back now the delay delay C minus C minus is here ok so now this line is on second line I will take a supply but I cannot give directly I cannot give directly the condition is when it reaches to S1 after A minus that is a C minus ok delay is there but A minus means it reaches to S1 first you confirm so S1 means so I have to confirm now it has to reach to S1 when it reaches to S1 my process will start delay because condition A minus condition is S1 then delay then C minus ok already this line is on ok so these are the mufflers ok now after this I have to take what delay pneumatic delay pure pneumatic delay now so delay is by using by using flow control wall and check wall the air should not goes now it closes through check wall but it should open through flow control wall it goes to where pneumatic accumulator pneumatic accumulator here accumulator you have to set accumulator so how much quantity of volume should goes inside there is a dial in that dial you will mention ok 1 second 2 second 3 second 4 second that much of fluid will go and after that it will return back due to spring then while returning the air it goes back to from the check wall while going now check wall is closed only flow control it goes to the accumulator after particular delay then the C minus it goes to S5 when it goes to S5 once again the cycle will repeat S5 means what the group 1 S5 this portion is on now group 1 is on once again A plus once again A plus it goes to S2 then S2 condition is satisfied then B plus it goes to S4 when S4 then it goes to where S6 when it S6 come to here ok this will be on this position is on then group 2 line is on and group 2 line is on B minus directly B minus ok so directly that is a B minus then A minus when it reaches to S3 A minus then uh, A minus means it goes to S1 ok S1 is on now then delay the delay this is called delay ok and accumulator after delay it goes to when S, S, uh, C minus is on the piston goes to S5 like this this cycle will continue ok so here the critical thing is that the S5 and S6 how to designate S5 and S6 so S5 is nothing but C minus C minus means S5 then after completion of first cycle 
the piston will be a 6 so after completion of first cycle before starting the second cycle a 6 no one should repeat s3 s2 s4 s1 s5 s6 no one is repeat okay now this is a special uh, problem this is called what delay the entire thing is called uh, what on delay timer it works like a on delay timer this is a on delay timer okay i'll show uh, the circuit how this circuit is working in a you see here this is simulation software the question is a plus b plus i have made a dash so first group and second group delay and c minus okay so same uh, thing i have drawn only i have to give a name c minus means what s6 yes, so i'll give here s6 yes, okay so when s6 yes, is there a plus a plus is now this is on a plus okay when it goes to s2 b plus b plus means what it, the first condition has to satisfied s2 yes, okay s2 yes, now it reaches to s4 then c plus so give the condition s4 yes, when it reaches to s4 then c plus when c plus it reaches to s6 now second cycle has to start so that i'll give s6 so s6 means below line is on now and b minus means directly b minus then a minus okay so a minus means what it has to reach to it has to reach to how okay now here i have to give so s5 because here you see here c minus last means what it reaches to s5 so that s5 okay s5 s6 fine so for once again i'll explain a my ac minus means what the piston goes to s5 so s5 i have given then a plus directly a plus okay then b plus but condition for b plus is s2 and b plus okay then s4 and c plus okay fine then b minus i have given directly b because when it reaches to s6 so second uh, wall is activated then second line is on and first line is off now b minus and a minus a minus but condition is it has to reach to s3 so that i'll give s3 when it reaches to s1 so you give the condition is s1 s1 then this is a on delay timer okay i'll set the volume 0.1 if your volume is more more delay time okay so now i'll start the animation first is a plus b plus then c plus then b minus then a minus then delay time delay then c minus okay i can vary the delay delay time depends the dial gauge is available 1 second 2 second 3 second 10 second so i'll set the uh, by using a dial as, as per that the spring will compress afterwards the spring will expand automatically the air will vent second time once again the air will fill in the accumulator a plus b plus then c plus then b minus then a minus then delay okay you see the, the entire what logic the logic is three cylinder as well as delay okay it's a very interesting problem i hope you underst understand as well as i'll upload this notes uh, i'll give the link below the video in the youtube you can see the notes also you can download the notes also thank you